Welcome back. Carrie joins us from the DeYoung Family Zoo. What do we have here today? This is adorable. Well, I actually brought two critters today. Okay. Two adorable critters to make you smile <laughs> on our rainy day. So this one is called a Patagonian Mara, or also known as the KV. Uh -huh. And it is from South America, mostly Argentina. And it's actually related to a common household pet, the guinea pig, which is also known as a KV. So there are several family members in this order. There's the capybara, which is the largest, uh -huh. then the paca, the agouti, the mara, and the guinea pig, and they're all rodents. And they're pretty calm animals? Yeah, they're actually very sweet. Um, okay. This one has actually been bottle raised by us at the zoo. Oh. And these guys, a lot of people confuse them with like a jackrabbit. Yeah. Because of the way that they look and the way that they stand, their back end is actually higher than their front end. Mm -hmm. Um, and they've got just a tiny little stub tail. They make sounds very similar to the guinea pig. They actually sound a lot like them. So um, these guys eat all kinds of uh, plants, and they are unfortunately prey for a lot of other animals. Oh, no. You guys have a lot of stuff going on at the zoo at this time? Yeah, it is the height of baby season. Oh. So we've got a lot of adorable critters. Our Carpathian lynx kittens are now at the zoo. They're from the only litter born in the U.S. this year, so we have two adorable little girls. They are right by the entrance to the zoo, and they are so playful and active, so fun to watch. And we have got lots of other babies. We actually just had another KV born at the zoo. Uh, we have a marmoset baby, all kinds of critters, and of course you get to interact with all of our babies during the animal encounter programs at the park. It's got to be one of the most fun times of the year, and then you guys also have uh, Bud's doing a book signing on Friday night, right? Yeah, Bud is actually coming down to Green Bay this Friday evening. He'll be at Barnes & Noble uh, at 6.30, mm -hmm. and he'll be signing his book. If you'd like to come out and meet Bud and get your book autographed, it's called It's a Wild Life, How My Life Became a Zoo. Uh, very <laughs> He's such a fun guy. What is the book about? <laughs> The book, we actually spent two years writing the book, and it's all about Bud growing up because a man who grows up to have a zoo in his backyard, <laughs> you know he was an interesting child. Yeah, he's got to have a book about that. So, yeah, it's actually about him growing up and how the zoo became what it is today. It's yeah. quite a unique story, so it's, it's a fun read. Thanks again for coming in this morning. We'll be right back. Thank you.